So let's watch what happens when we add the foam pieces to the oil. There it goes. See that's instantly soaking up the oil. And as you can see, we make quick work of the spill. Foam pieces. Absolutely. These. <laughs> by extracting these, as yeah. you can see, pretty much all the oil has been removed from the, the container. Okay, as you can see, we've, we've used these foam pieces once before. We're going to reuse them again, uh, and they will be able to, again, soak up oil. And now we will show you uh, the extraction rate. Right, and uh, one of the reasons we're doing this is because the, one of the properties of the foam is that it is elastomeric, meaning flexible. So we can squeeze these things out. We've squeezed them all day within an inch of their lives, but we could literally do this, soak up oil, squeeze out, recover the oil thousands of times before they would start to degrade. So let's go ahead and put it in again, and, and we've added quite a bit more oil so that we can show you just how much we can extract. And as you can yeah, see, even it really starts used. soaking up. And again, you can see that the foam is doing exactly what it should do, which is soaking up and getting the oil immediately. Now, on an ongoing process, we will bring these in and out and continually soak them with oil to retrieve the oil from the gulf and other areas. And then simply by taking this oil, as you can see, soaked up quite a bit. Yeah, that was covered with oil. Yes, we can take this now and we can actually pick these up and take them out. And as you can see, even at, after we added an, an incredible amount of oil, we have reused these several times and again, we're extracting oil. And as you can see, even just sim by simply pushing in, you can see the amount of oil that we can actually extract from the gulf in a very fast and efficient manner. Oh, that's amazing. We can extract oil after oil after oil and get it out. And the outcome again is from here, 